Hello everybody, welcome to Slime Rancher. Slime Rancher is the tale of Beatrix the Bow, a plucky young rancher who sets out for a thousand light years away from the earth on a far, far range, where she tries her hand at making a living wrangling slimes. With a can-do attitude, plenty of grit, and her trusty backpack, Beatrix attempts to strike a or stake a claim, amass a fortune, and avoid the continual peril that looms from the rolling, jiggling avalanches of slime around every corner. This game is just available right now, the pre-alpha build. So pre-alpha means that there's going to be a lot of bugs, a lot of missing features, and is not representative of the final product. But even in its early state, it's very fun. This game is slated to come out on PC, Mac, and Linux in 2016, and is being developed by uh, Monomi Park. You find information for the developer, the game, uh, the Twitter, all that good stuff will be in the description below. Be sure to check that out. And let's jump right in. Uh, we're gonna do a new game, uh, game two, sure. I don't know, I don't really know what to call it. But uh, this game, uh, the reason I'm excited for this game is it seems like it, uh, well, that's kind of funny. It seems like it's in the same vein as a sort of shopkeep game. I, I like this, this trend. It's kind of like a new genre that's been coming out. It's probably not new, it's probably been games like it before, but the whole first person management game. Because I feel like there have been tons of management or simulation type type games, but they're usually from uh, top-down perspectives, like some notable ones, I'm thinking like, um, oh, what was that pharmacy game? I don't know. <laughs> Big Pharma? I'm trying to remember the name of the game that came out earlier. But you know what I mean, those type of top-down management games. Uh, but I like this because it's similar to Shopkeep in the way that you have the first person. What does this button do? But welcome to the game slime rancher we are beatrix blibbo and here we are on our distant planet it's supposed to be a futuristic cartoonish stylized planet with these little guys hey there buddy how you doing i got a little flashlight for you they're so adorable <laughs> oh man as soon as i saw the trailer for this game i knew that i wanted to play it he is really getting he's getting some height there he's leaving a little bit of goo behind hey buddy Oh, they're so adorable. But now, whoop, get in here. All right, new, new Slimepedia entry, pink slime. Their coral hue is scientifically proven to be the color of cheer. I can see that. They look super cheerful. New Vecta slime. Slimes are key to your success. Shoot slimes through the uh, coral, corral, I keep saying coral, corral barrier <laughs> into the corral on the ranch. So left, or uh, mouse wheel, we can select the vac tank. So we have four different tanks on our vac right now. And then hold left, we can shoot it. So there it goes. Yay, we have one pink slime. And he has, you can see in the top right, he has a diet of everything. And diet's going to be very important. Does this actually lower the shields? Okay, so you can actually edit the corrals. Okay, let's get moving. So we have basic WASD controls. They're in the controls. It does have options for gamepad. I haven't tried that out yet. And I want to try this. So apparently there's a record GIF feature. That's not something I see in games a lot. I see the screenshot feature, but recorded GIFs would be cool. That would really help this game become viral in that success. Because, I mean, those, on Reddit, I mostly see... You see, uh, GIFs have a lot more success than videos, in my opinion. So that might be something we could try. We can try and make a, a viral GIF in this game. All right, we can hold Sprint to Sprint, which is Shift. Or we can do little space bar jumps. All right, how to vac like a ranch. Your vac pack and vac up things and store them in a vac tank. Yep, so right click. We can vacuum things up. You can see there's uh, there's a little house there. I should probably go over the beginning of the whole map. So we have a house here. Indoors, you can uh, pass time by uh, sleep until morning. Uh, you can return to the ranch or we have star mail. Welcome to the far, far range. This is from the management. Welcome to your range. You can get started. <laughs> All right, we got like, we got like uh, cowboy speak and then we got like old timey speak. I don't know what's going on here. You can get started. Uh, with some simple wrangling of pink slimes and work your way up to some of the more ordinary critters as you get your footing. Alright, so seems like they just want us to get some pink slimes. Which we can do. Ah, oh, carrots! Next to uh, the backpack, it's Ranch's best friends. Tasty food acquired. Foods like fruits, veggies, and chickens are used to feed slimes. Try shooting at a pink slime, they'll eat anything. Alright, so we can select the carrot over here. We can go up to our first little buddy. Here, buddy, you want a carrot? Go eat the carrot, buddy. Oh, let me get that. Come here. Come here. Oh, oh sorry, buddy. <laughs> okay, I accidentally sucked the slime. Okay, there you go. Have a carrot. 
Have a carrot, buddy. Come on. Oh, is he going to get it? Is he going to eat it? Come on. Maybe he's not hungry. Come on, buddy. Get the carrot. Are you not hungry? No, I don't want you here. There he goes. Oh, he's all. Oh, he's so happy. Oh, and he pooped out a little pink plort. You've acquired a slime plort. When slimes eat, they make plorts. Oh, so is that his poop? Did he just poop at me? When, uh, head over to the plort mark or market to cash in your plort. So I believe the plort market is right over here. I believe. The plort market gives you new bucks for your hard earned plorts. <laughs> this game. It's one of those things where it just sounds ridiculous, especially I imagine as we get further in the game, we're going to be saying this here. It's like, man, I need some more plorts. <laughs> Why can't I get any more plorts from my pink little slime friends? Shoot a plort into the plort market and earn some cash. So, boink, there we go. And you see uh, on the bottom left there, we have our stanima, sta stanima, our health, and I believe those are that's our cash, a little end. So let's try and gather some more food and slimes. We'll try to get some more plorts. So we'll head out here. You saw these areas over here. So this is the basic starting area for the ranch. You have a couple corrals. Uh, and then past there, you have these shields, uh, which allow you to expand. Is that a plort? Nice, got a free plort. Yeah, so you can uh, proceed to activate. You can overgrow the ranch's very own wild side. So we can buy that for 350 caches. Oh yeah, and I guess you can open Slimepedia sometimes, uh, but it does help where Slimepedia. There's these little stations right by the plort mark. So we have Slimepedia. We have the information on the backpack slimes. We have the pink slime, and these will fill up as more get discovered. There's a bunch of different types of slimes. In fact, there are some pretty dangerous slimes out there too. Resources, carrots, ranch. We have our corrals, our coops, our gardens, because we can eventually grow food. There's farming elements in this game as well. A silo, incinerator, a pond. Cool. Plort, mar <laughs> Plort market, overgrowth, and the grotto. So these are the two places we can buy. Uh, the expansions to the ranch, it's slightly spooky. Oh, there's light sensitive slimes, awesome. And then here's the ranch. So we have the ranch right now, and all we have is the slime sea. Yeah, I don't want to fall on that. I did that, uh, you don't die, I think you just got knocked out for a full day. And then you just start up again. But let's go check it out guys, let's uh, move on out. I am enjoying the visuals in this game, it's a very pretty looking game, especially for this early. I th think it's Unity? I'm not 100% sure on that. I, I can never tell. New Slimepedia entry. Alright, the Dry Reef. A coral crusted ocean floor that now basks under a golden sun. Okay, so I guess this used to be an ocean floor. Oh, we got some wild slimes. What did I just get? What was that? Oh, hi buddy. Come on in. I got a box here. I don't know what I do with the box. Can I break it? Oh! There's a chicken. Chicken, 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 chicken. Okay, come on in. Oh. Okay, we got a hen hen, a hearty chicken bread to be twice as tasty as his cousin on earth. Awesome. So, so what is this guy? That must be a rooster or something. That looks like a strawberry. Now, we'll come back for them because you can only hold four different types of things in your vac at once. I'm sure, like, that'll be upgrade. Ooh, lots of carrots. Excellent. Lots of plink plorts. Pink slimes, look at them all. <laughs> they seem so cheery about their impending doom. Whoa, they're literally coming out of the walls. One of my favorite things is watch what happens once we get 20 slimes in here. Okay, I don't think there's enough over here to show you. Come on, we need two more. What do we got here? Oh, something else we can't get. Whoa! Whoa. And boink. <laughs> God, I never sold. <laughs> just smack their little faces onto it. Boink, I'm sorry, buddies. Ah, some more plorts. Don't know what that was. It looked like an onion something. Cormac, what you want, buddy? The puppy's running up to me. Here's me laughing. He's like, what's so funny? <laughs> all right, look at this. Oh, man. Got all new regions over here. Got to see how the water... Ooh, there's a big purple dude over there. For some reason, I'm getting a um, kind of Zelda feel out of this. I never played Wind Waker, um, but just looking at this... Wind Waker was that Zelda one, right? They kind of had the, um, the cell shaded graphics. Boink! Oh, just shot the chicken out. Or the hen hen. Oh! Alright, these guys. We want to keep our distance for now. Uh, let's, let's show you what they do. So you walk up to them. Oh, did he just eat? Okay, I thought he ate another pink slime. I think he may have eaten a carrot. Ooh! Hen hen, come back. 
Alright. What is this? Oh, this must be their plorts. Ah! Okay, ah! Oh. oh, sorry guys. Is this another area? What do we got here? Alright, so it looks like this is under construction. So maybe it will be available in later updates. I'm not sure. Hi, kitty! Hi! Ooh, more head hens. Okay, I'll take the head hens. So I do have a spot for them in my vax. Now this, this is where the slimes were coming out of in the other areas. Wonder, is, is that where they grow? Hmm. All right, we, we, we can go check out this stuff later. Uh, let's head back to the ranch and see what we got going on. Ooh, more plorts. Come here, pink plorts. Look at this. It's like a little, is that a cat? <laughs> is he, are they riding each other or are they mating? Should I be giving them privacy? I don't know what's going on here, but it's kind of freaking me out. Or is that, or is that only, is that a single creature? No, there's two of them. He just, he just has a cat on his head. All right, a lot of interesting stuff. Oh no, no. Oh, I think we just saw a slime commit suicide. There, but for the grace of God. Poor little bastards. All right, let's head back to the ranch and get ourselves situated there. All right, we're here. Maybe maybe this music has reminded me of Lon Lon Ranch. Maybe that's where that's coming from. All right, let's toss our pink slimes in. Let's just try something. Cause I think we shoot a little forward. And boom 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 boom. Alright, see how how many of those actually go in. Alright. Oh that one was on the room. Oh jeez, okay, yeah. Oh. Alright, so not a lot of them made it in, unfortunately. Are they bouncing out? Or are these the guys that are already out? You guys stay in there. Thank God for this sort of one-way shield thing. But yeah, this music really reminded me of uh, Lon Lon Ranch in Ocarina of Time. Ocarina, however you guys want to say it. I, people used to tell me that all the time. It was Ocarina. I was like, oh, I'm going to call it Ocarina, alright? Do what I want. <gasps> Look at them all. <laughs> Yay! Alright, let's shoot some carrots in their faces. Oh, they're so, oh, they're getting so big and strong. They're getting so big and strong. I wonder, it'd be nice if you could set your vac to only collect certain things. Like, I want to collect these plorts, but I don't want the slimes. So if we could set it to pick up the plorts, that'd be great. Oh, how did you get back in there, you? Okay, ooh, another hen hen. Grab that. Uh, we need a coop for our hen, hen hens. What do we got here? Backpack upgrades, awesome. We'll have a jet pack. <gasps> Dash boots. Okay, more sprinting pulse wave. Pushes away slimes whenever you need personal space. All right, heart module. All right, boosting health, power core. All right, gives more energy and a tank booster. 320 units, awesome, yeah, so fully upgradable systems there. Let's go sell these bad boys. Oh, you can't hold it down, okay. Right, did we drop one? Ah, oh, there it is. Back here, you little Gashuvna. Okay. Uh, what did we want? We wanted... Where do we buy stuff? Here? Oh, okay, yeah, duh. It's right next there. Okay, so you just go up these things. And we can go ahead and purchase a coop for our hen hens. There we go. Got some chicken chicks. Hey there, fellas. Food type meat. Can we feed them to the slimes? <laughs> Maybe we'll get some more vicious ones. Uh, that'd be pretty awesome. Yeah, full day-night cycle, looking pretty good. I like our little house. Hopefully, um, I'll have to check out, I haven't actually looked at any sort of roadmap by the developers, so a bunch of the stuff I'm saying will probably be added, but maybe an actual building that you could walk inside. Of course they're going to do that. that, that seems fairly obvious, like an actual, excuse me, I just drink a bunch of water and I get the hiccups. Uh, an actual structure you can go inside and maybe customize or build a new house or just, just go inside instead of just the, um, the little splash, splash screen that it gives you right now. Oh, more plorts. Give me them plorts. I don't want you, I just want the plorts. Alright. Oh, ten hen. Alright, but I think we're gonna do a relatively short series on this game for now, guys. Just on the pre-alpha version, we'll probably revisit the game uh, as it gets further developed. Maybe checking out the updates every now and then. Have a carrot. There you go. Achievement unlocked, catch. Hooray, there's achievements. Awesome. Pretty impressive for pre-alpha. 
Uh, definitely leave a like if you guys enjoyed, want to see more in the future. Uh, yeah, I'll see you guys next time for some more Slime Rancher. Be sure to check it out in the description if you guys are interested in following the development of this game. And I'll be sure to keep you guys up to date with all current information. I'll see you next time. Bye.